Good morning and welcome to another edition of Robert's Recap. As a reminder, this is where the core team and I attempt to bring you three of the most salient agenda items from our most recent board meeting, and I attempt to do this in three minutes or less. Let's jump right in. At last night's board meeting, as is customary now, we kick off the board meeting with a celebration of students. Our Grandview Elementary students, under the leadership of Dr. Jabonsky, presented to us last night a project that they are proud of. They were awarded first place for raising the most amount of food in partnership with a project with the food bank. Our Grandview Bees were able to raise 800 pounds of food, where they were gonna donate us to the food bank in order for us to meet the needs of a lot of our community members near and far who are either parts of food deserts or who do not have access readily to healthy, safe foods. Grandview Elementary, we are proud of our students and the teachers and staff. The second agenda item is one that really aligns to a focus that we've had for the past several years, and that is improving and renovating all of our projects, capital projects that is, our school buildings and our athletic facilities. This one is what many community members have shared with me has been a long time coming. The board last night approved to renovate and upgrade our baseball and softball facilities including the entire Hanlon complex, which means that the lighting for the complex will be upgraded for the very first time. This project will cost the district and the board approximately $4.7 million, but it's a worthy investment. Our young people and student athletes, as well as this community, deserve it. One of the projects that was placed in hold or given a little bit of a pause is the renovation and upgrade of McDowell High School. This is a project that will cost us approximately $40 million and the board will certainly receive some additional information from my core team, my CFO and I, and we are certainly looking forward to receiving additional input from our McDowell families. This project will likely be completed, but we just have to find a way forward and a time to get it started. Three items in three minutes or less. We look forward to seeing you at another Robert's Recap.